uh hi guys so in this video um i'll be continuing on this um uh, project type collisions um video so i was in this video we were covering how to set up collisions for um for bullets or projectiles right and then i realized that you might run into this issue where your bullets are not colliding right so some bullets are colliding some bullets are not i mean some projectiles are colliding and some are not so first i'm going to play uh i want to press play here and two things will happen um some bullets will collide and some bullets will go through the wall uh which makes the system unreliable right because we are counting on this um this uh this event to be um triggered every time and uh we actually just want um reliable collisions every time especially if you are developing a game so uh, i'm gonna press play and then some bullets will go through some bullets will collide okay so you saw that some bullets were going through and some were colliding and this happens it's more pronounced the higher you go for your um your projectile speed so right um, if you increase the speed uh the higher the chances that the collision system gets um unreliable right so <clears throat> i'm gonna show you how to fix this um there's only one setting you need to mess with right inside your um collision component or if it's your mesh right if you scroll down to the um, collision settings right um right here and then go into advanced there's this setting right here uh ccd right um if you hold control and alt you can read the description which tells you that cc does a, a more accurate um physics calculation and it can be used when objects are moving at high speeds okay so if you take this um unreal engine will assign more cpu power to computing physics for this um for this actor right uh, for this collision box which means the collisions will be accurate um pretty much 100 percent of the time unlike before so you see that after i take this uccd on our collision uh the bullets will collide um, every time okay that's it that's the fix that's the video that's that short and um if you're wondering how i'm triggering these bullets uh, i'm using this um this plugin uh, uh it sends uh MIDI events uh, and then it helps you uh drive game events using MIDI so that uh, your game events are synced to uh, to music right um i've covered this in the other videos here but i just wanted to let you know about this plugin right here that's how i'm doing that um synced shooting uh the shooting that's sent to the music so yeah